Hello, how is your bowel doing? Any issues lately? Today, we'll discuss the seven warning signs of colorectal cancer and why it's crucial to be informed about this type of tumor. Colorectal cancer is the third most common cancer and the second deadliest, accounting for about 10 of cancer-related deaths, so stay tuned. This video is divided into two parts. The first part covers the signs and symptoms of colon cancer that you might notice or feel, and the second part, which I believe is the most critical, will focus on prevention. I'll discuss habits, dietary choices, and lifestyle changes to reduce your risk as well as the issue of polyps and the rising incidence of colon cancer in people under 50. It's going to be an informative session, so stay until the end. Let me know if you know anyone with colon cancer and where you're from in the comments below. If you're visiting our channel for the first time, we'd be thrilled if you joined us on YouTube and Facebook. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more informative content, and follow us on Facebook to stay updated with the latest news and articles. Your support means the world to us, and we look forward to having you as part of our community. Let's begin with the seven warning signs that might indicate a bowel issue. Sign 7. Changes in Bowel Habits Maintaining awareness of your bowel habits is important for your overall health. Bowel movements can vary significantly from person to person. Some individuals have a routine of going after breakfast, while others may have multiple bowel movements throughout the day or only a few times per week. The key is recognizing what is normal for your body. Persistent changes in your bowel habits warrant medical attention. Around two-thirds of individuals with bowel cancer experience alterations in their bowel movements, such as changes in stool consistency, color, frequency, or alternating between diarrhea and constipation. Unexplained. Prolonged diarrhea, followed by constipation, can be a concerning sign that should be evaluated by a healthcare provider. While changes in bowel habits alone do not necessarily indicate a serious underlying condition, it's important not to ignore them. Seeking medical advice can help identify the root cause and rule out potentially serious issues like bowel cancer. Maintaining open communication with your doctor about any persistent changes in your bowel function is crucial for ensuring timely diagnosis and appropriate treatment if necessary. By being proactive about monitoring your bowel health, you can take an important step in safeguarding your overall well-being. Sigh. Bloating. Abdominal bloating or swelling can occur due to partial or complete blockage of the bowel by a tumor, leading to a buildup of gas and stool. This can also cause colicky abdominal pain and should not be ignored. Sign 2. Unexplained weight loss. Unintended weight loss even without changes in diet or exercise, can be a symptom of colorectal cancer. Tumors can interfere with nutrient absorption, increase energy expenditure, and cause loss of appetite due to the production of certain cytokines. Sign 1. Feeling of incomplete evacuation, also known as tenismus. This is the sensation that your bowel hasn't fully emptied, even after a bowel movement. This can be caused by a tumor partially blocking the bowel, leading to thin ribbon-like stools. If you experience this, it is crucial to see a doctor. Risk factors for colorectal cancer. Colorectal cancer risk is influenced by various factors, some of which are unchangeable, while others can be managed through lifestyle choices. As we age, the risk of developing colorectal cancer naturally increases. Individuals with inflammatory bowel diseases such as Crohn's disease or ulcerative colitis, are at higher risk. Certain genetic syndromes, like Lynch syndrome or familial adenomatous polyposis, also significantly elevate the likelihood of colorectal cancer. A family history of colorectal cancer, particularly having a close relative with the disease, further raises the risk. Interestingly, taller individuals have been found to have a higher risk as well. Lifestyle choices play a crucial role in colorectal cancer risk. Smoking is a well-known risk factor for various cancers, including colorectal cancer. Similarly, alcohol consumption can increase the risk. A sedentary lifestyle, characterized by a lack of regular exercise, is another significant risk factor. Diet is also critical. Consuming a diet low in fruits and vegetables but high in processed foods and red meat can elevate the risk of colorectal cancer. 
The rising incidence of colorectal cancer among younger individuals is concerning. This trend is largely attributed to poor dietary habits, a lack of physical activity, and increasing obesity rates. These factors collectively contribute to earlier onset of the disease. In response, health experts now recommend starting colorectal cancer screening at age 45 for those at intermediate risk. Early screening aims to detect cancer at an earlier, more treatable stage, thereby improving survival rates and outcomes for younger populations. Prevention tips for colorectal cancer. Staying hydrated by drinking plenty of water helps your bowels function better and reduces constipation. Eating a diet rich in fruits and vegetables is crucial as they are high in fiber and antioxidants, which promote healthy bowel function. Reducing the intake of red meat, especially processed meats, is important since these foods are high in harmful chemicals linked to colorectal cancer. Incorporating natural anti-inflammatories like turmeric and cinnamon into your diet can also help. Consuming dairy products, contrary to some beliefs, can offer protection against colorectal cancer. Regular exercise is vital, not only for maintaining bowel function, but also for overall health. One of the most effective prevention strategies is regular screening. Screening, such as colonoscopies, can detect polyps before they become cancerous. If you are over 45 or at intermediate risk, it is advisable to consider undergoing a colonoscopy. This procedure involves cleaning out the bowel beforehand and then under sedation, having a doctor examine your colon and remove any polyps. This proactive approach is a highly effective way to prevent colorectal cancer and ensure early detection if cancer does develop. Regular screening is key to maintaining colon health and reducing the risk of colorectal cancer. If you found our video helpful, we'd be thrilled if you subscribed to our YouTube channel, followed us on Facebook, and shared this video with your friends and family. Don't forget to leave a comment too. We love hearing your thoughts and feedback. Your support means the world to us and helps us continue bringing you valuable content. Thank you.